Welcome! In front of me I have Sunto 9 Peak and I'm gonna show you how to enable the phone notifications for this watch on the Android phone. Basically, if you want to receive the notifications from your phone on the watch. Before we start, if you want to receive the notifications on your watch, your watch needs to be paired with a phone via the Sunto application. Once the devices are paired, we can continue and now we can open the Sunto application on our phone that is paired with our watch. In the app, you should see the homepage. Now tap on the uh, watch icon right here at the top of the homepage. And this should open the uh, device page for your Sunto uh, 9 Peak. And on this page, you need to wait until it says connected right here. So basically until the watch syncs with your phone. Once it does, scroll down and tap on the notifications on the watch option. And here we can enable the notifications. To enable them, we need to allow a couple of permissions. For example, we have the notification access and next to it we have allow. We don't have a check mark, we need to, we have the allow button. Tap on it and this will redirect you to the notification access. Here, find the Sunto application on the list, tap on it, tap on the switch, tap on allow. And then you can tap on the back button to go back to the app. And as you can see, the notification access changed Basically, we have the check mark right, right here now. And now we need to en enable more permissions like telephone, contacts and call logs. The telephone is already enabled, but we need to enable the contacts or rather allow the contacts permission and allow the call logs permission. So let's tap on the allow, tap on continue, tap on allow, and then tap on the allow to allow the contact and phone access. And once you're done with the permissions, you should see all of the check marks right here. Once you see the check marks, you can scroll down and at the bottom we have the list of applications installed on our um, phone and we can allow and deny the permissions for them by tapping the switches next to them. So if you disable the permissions or other uh, notifications for this um, app, so for example, I'm gonna disable the notifications for Chrome, you won't receive the notifications from Chrome on your watch, but you will receive them on your phone basically. So the phone won't forward the notifications to your watch from the Chrome and different apps you decide to uh, maybe turn off the notifications for. So uh, customize your settings and once you're done you can close the app. No, no, don't close the app, my bad. Once you're done go back to the device page of your watch and wait until you the watch is done syncing with your phone and settings apply. Once it says connected now you can close the app and at this point you should be able to receive the notifications on your watch. So I'm gonna send myself a message on Discord. And as you can see, we got the message on our watch, or rather on our phone and also on our watch. Okay. And that's how you enable the phone notifications on for this watch on the Android phone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video.